Hi guys, Tech James here. In this video, I'll show you how to install a Nintendo DS emulator on any iPhone running iOS 9 to iOS 11. So the link will be in the description. You just want to head over to Safari. It's called um, iEmulators.com and the emulator is called iNDS. So what you want to do, you want to scroll down. Just scroll down until you get to this part here that just says INDS updated. You just want to tap that. Then it's just going to come up with this pop up. What you want to do is just hit install. Then you just want to tap install INDS. Then just give it a few seconds and it will come up asking if you'd like to install it and just hit install. Now the app should be installing. What you can do from here is just back out to your home screen. As you can see, the app is installing there. If you tap it, it'll come up with this um, notice saying untrusted developer. So what you want to do, you want to head over to your settings. Scroll down to general. Then scroll down again until you get to profiles and device management. And then as you can see, there's a new profile down here. You just want to tap on that and then go on trust, trust again. Once that's trusted, you can back out to your home screen. Okay, so now what we need to do, we have got the emulator working. You can open it up. You can see that it works. Um, there may be a few ads, you can just skip them. But as you can see, it looks kind of basic and there's actually no ROMs. So what we need to do here is actually get some ROMs. So we're just going to back out to the home screen again, open up Safari. So you want to go to this website. You want to go to loveroms.com and you want to go to the Nintendo DS section. So I'm in a DS section right here, the link will be in the description. You guys can just choose any game you want. I'm going to go ahead and choose um, New Super Mario Bros. There are a few ads on here you might want to click off of. Okay, so I'm on the app um, game right here, scroll down and it would say, it has a green download button. So what you want to do is just hit download now. It's then going to bring up a pop-up. And it says here, open in INDS, so you just want to tap that. So it is added, as you can see the game is now on the list, you can do this for as many DS games as you run. I'm just going to go ahead and launch this and show you guys there's some gameplay. So I'm just going to go ahead and go and launch normally. So the touch screen works just like normal, you can literally just tap it like that. Keep in mind that I'm using an iPhone 5C, most of you guys are probably using like iPhone 6 or iPhone 7 and it will work perfectly fine on that. So it does run on here, it's just there's a bit of delay. Um, there are some options up here, um, you can change the speed, there are cheats, emulator settings, um, you can actually turn, I'm pretty sure you can turn um, the show FPS full screen settings all that kind of stuff you can make the controller opacity less so you can see it a bit less but yeah let's just um, start the game So the game seems to run fine at 23 FPS. The max FPS on Nintendo DS games is 30 anyway. But obviously if you've got a better iPhone than this, then it will run um, at 100% full speed. Right guys, that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys enjoyed, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.